I feel bad, Freddy. So. Feel better. South America's finest. Salute. Hey. Hey. My little brother. I love him. I know you don't want to see me, and I know you don't want to hear from me, but there's something that I had to do. All right, look here, that, that's my Rolex. It's worth a lot of money. I don't know how much, but I know it's worth a lot. And I got some cash here. It's almost like 200 bucks. It's all I got. Well, what's this for, Dominic? I thought you were clean. Look, Hannah, just because I want to help out doesn't mean that I did nothing. All right, all right, look. Just suppose, all right, just suppose that I know these guys who knew about your robbery, all right? Just suppose. And then I get the feeling bad about everything. It I was $4,000, you asshole. Don't try and buy me off as a Ritz watch. Hannah, Hannah, Hannah. This is a Rolex. I mean, look at this watch. That $4,000 broke my mother's back. The insurance ain't gonna pay it. So we're not gonna make it. We don't have it. I don't even know who does. I swear to God, I'll pay you back. I swear to God, Hannah, I don't got it. Look, what if I pay you back a little at a time? I'll give you like a hundred bucks a month. I hear your brother does all right for himself. You want to help so much, why don't you get the money from him? But that kind of money, Freddie, will kill me. What do you want from me? You want me to cry for you? Why don't you get away from our house? I don't know how to make it any clearer to you people. Central is a depressed high school. In recent years, it's been characterized by a drop in attendance, falling test scores, violence, increased drug traffic. What are we gonna do to get you to keep our school open? Hey, we ain't any worse than Fenimore. Yeah, we're very solid. Yeah, what about them? Yeah. This is a decision that has come down from Albany, from the state board, and there is no changing it. He's not gonna listen to us. I don't know why we bother. You got that right. You got the truth. We all appreciate your feelings here. Oh, yeah. I grew up here, too. I went to school with some of you. But in June, this school is gonna be closed. That is not fair. These gentlemen will begin working at the school Monday to oversee the orderly and final disassembly of the school plan. Not in my classroom. Nobody you will please give them your fullest cooperation. Thank you. No. Now, no, wait a minute, all right? That's it? What about our sing? What are you going to do about sing? All no extracurricular way. activities will be terminated. We don't have the budget. Now, wait just one minute. Every year for 40 years, every high school class in Brooklyn has staged this show. And with every year passing, it's become more... Th this show has become part of the community, That's Elliot. Right. It's a tradition. So you're not only going to close our school, you're going to... You're going to take away Sing, too? This is a community in crisis, Mr. Fry. And that is precisely why this is happening. Oh. You think I personally am doing this? You think we invent these statistics? What have statistics got to do with the school show, for Christ's sake? My Cecilia, my daughter, she made her own costumes. Yeah. We cannot afford Mr. To... Fry, it wouldn't have to cost you a cent. It wouldn't have to cost anybody anything. Young lady, you are out of order. Hey, hey. Hey, let her talk. Mr. Scarpetti, you own a paint store, right? You could give us some paint, huh? I'll give them all the paint they need. I have lumber. Anybody needs lumber, they got it. Oh, boy, hey, Mr. Fry. Hey, Mr. Fry, look at this. Cecilia, show them your splits.
Elliot at Fry may be closing down this school. But as long as I'm principal, he's not going to tell me how to run it. I've been working too long inside this system not to find a way to work outside it, Teresa. And no four-eyed son of a bitch from the Board of Education is going to stop me from giving my kids one final thing. All right, you guys, they're going to close our school. We can't stop them. They're telling us we're not worth anything. <laughs> Mr. Marowitz has put his ass on the line for us to prove different. So we've got to do everything we can away from the school so nobody at the Board of Ed finds out. I don't know where the underclassmen are hiding out to rehearse. But you got to remember, they got Mrs. Devere. And we all know Mrs. Devere. She doesn't take defeat lightly.